Hey, all right, back we are with more Mega Man Maker today. We will be playing through the Shotman Hideout, uh, created by Gear Boy, with templates and a score of positive two. Yep, and we only have the Buster. Okay, and yeah, supposedly this uh, level as well <clears throat> is not a beginner uh, beginner friendly level. Yeah, as it. Uh, tells you there in the start and it seems to be a wily type uh, wily type level we only have the regular buster too so yeah I'm going to have to try and keep that in mind wow <laughs> man I just went for it hm. oh oh yes you know what we good oh <laughs> I thought it would be one of those fire guys popping up, so yeah, I just... Yeah, I got scared. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Yeah, I'm doing pretty well so far, and... Jeez, that looks... That looks hard, let's do it. <laughs> what the hell? Immediately dies. Immediately. <laughs> what the hell, man? Hmm. Alright, well. Luckily, I didn't die too far in, so yeah. Hmm. That's nice. If you just go faster, you can just, you know, on the first cycle, make it through. But yeah, if I die again in that ladder segment, um, I will just. Cut back, uh, so you don't have to <laughs> watch me go through it every time. But yeah, I think I have it this time. I just need to keep a little bit higher up here. <laughs> oh, jeez, that guy is up there. Oh, you know what? <laughs> yeah. I'll just... I'll just use him. Hmm. Now, this room looks pretty neat, I have to say. Okay, so we did get the big health for going there, so yeah, I was at full health, so <laughs> I probably didn't need that on my first attempt there, so yeah. Oh well. Hmm? Wow, oh yo yo. <laughs> that was a little bit. Just a little bit scary. Just a little bit. Oh, and did you see that? There's a freaking guy hidden in there. Yeah, <laughs> it was spine enemy hidden in the oil. I didn't even know you could hide them in that. Oh, <laughs> yeah, that's kind of funny. I, I actually did not know that. Hmm. Oh, I see, I see. Just gotta be careful with it. <laughs> with not. Oh, you're yeah, yeah, holding down the freaking jump button all the way, basically. Yeah, I probably should have grabbed the health, but honestly, I think I will be. I think I will be fine. And jeez, yeah. Oh, wow. Man, oh man, oh, what the hell? <laughs> yeah. Hmm. We did not hit a checkpoint, so yeah, this stage definitely is a lot harder than the previous stage uh, that I tried out. From Gear Boy. Definitely a lot harder. And here I am talking instead of cutting back. <laughs> well, whatever. Hmm. Yeah, but this time, uh, <laughs> I will definitely go for the top path here. Yeah. You're gonna mess up pretty badly if you need that health. There we have some <clears throat> pretty nice introduction to the whatever this item here is called. The freaking I thought I was telling you. the flicking, <laughs> the flicking, the freaking uh, flip switch. Oh man, I just realized I'm going to have to do this hard one up here again. 
uh, with spikes in the in the ceiling. Yeah, this one is pretty tough. Yeah, you just gotta wait while you stand on it, so you don't have to compensate by jumping. You know, just wait, do a small, small jump. Uh, it's much better just falling from failing rather than going too high and up into the spikes. That's for damn sure. Yeah, but now we're back. Um, I'm sensing a checkpoint, you know, past this segment here. I, I, oh, jeez. <laughs> Something crashed over in my kitchen. <laughs> but yeah, I'm sensing that I'm very close to a checkpoint here. No! Oh! Nice! Perfect timing, okay. Wow, okay, that's a scary amp. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I was so freaking close. But yeah, that is a dreadful jump there at the end. Uh, that's for damn sure. Hey, not easy by any means. Oi! Okay, um. Uh. There you go. Okay. Oh! <laughs> yeah, but we got the tank. We got it. Yeah. <clears throat> I guess that's something to like Oh wait, let me just focus. Yeah, I guess that is something to consider um when putting away an E tank like uh What am I trying to say? Uh yeah if you don't want the player to be able to get the E tank and die and reset with it, um uh, there are some ways to try and build, you know, the layout so that the player can't get the E-Tank and escape with it, you know, by dying. There are ways around that, but yeah. Like, if it was a regular Mega Man game, you know, dying would, you know, at least subtract a 1-up, but yeah. Oh, we don't have the 1-up system in this game, so dying is not all that bad. Whatever, I, I don't know if I'm making much sense here, but... <laughs> Whatever, okay. And this is very tricky, too. Hey! <laughs> Jeez! Jeez Louise! Imagine going through all of that without this checkpoint here. <laughs> Imagine doing that. Oh okay. yeah. Oh! Hey! <laughs> Wow! Whew! Dude, that was... <laughs> that was scary. Ah! No! Yo! Yo! <laughs> oh! Man! Man, oh man! Ah, uh, I'll just cut back. See you in a sec. Alright, here we are. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. There we go, that should do it. Ooh. Okay. Okay, now, can we... let's just try and destroy this guy, and now, we die on the spike. <laughs> okay, cutting back again. Alright, here we are again. And, yeah, there is a way to cheese this, I guess. Like, if you just touch the shield attacker before jumping down here, you can do it the easy peasy way, you know, the cheesy way. Uh, but yeah. I will try and not do that and just... Come on! <laughs> oh, cutting back again! <laughs> okay, back again. Now! There, finally! Yeah, you just gotta trust yourself. Can't be... Oh, nice! <laughs> Can't be too scared there. Yeah, we have a standard, well, not not a standard fight with Napalm Man, but, you know, a kind of standard fight. Yeah, if, if Napalm Man is down in a pit, oh, it's going to be very hard to dodge the Napalm. Oh, okay. Yeah, but if, if Napalm Man is down in a pit and shoots up the Napalm, um, 
if you have to go forward towards Snape Man, I don't think you can get under. Um, so yeah, you're definitely going to have to think about positioning here. Oops. <laughs> Dang it. Dang it. Okay. But yeah, then again, if he's down in a pit and sh start shooting missiles, it's going to be easier to dodge, so... Yeah. There is that, too. Dang it! Man, I'm not playing well! Haha, <laughs> one health! Ah, oh, come on now. And I guess, like, well, yeah, we don't have the charge buster, which also makes Snape on man a lot easier. Um, and, you know, of course, it is a little bit trickier. The terrain is a little bit trickier than in a regular flat surface room, you know? So, yeah. Oh, 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 yo, yo, wow. Here, just go here. Dang it. But yeah, like, Napalm Man is probably one of the, I don't know, like, he's kind of tricky to get a flawless run on, you know, without taking hits. But, oh, shoot. But he's definitely not the worst uh, Robot Master either. Um, yeah. <laughs> oh! But yeah, oh, pretty nice stage uh, overall, Gear Boy. Uh, this one certainly. Uh, let's just go ahead and upload that. Uh, this one certainly was a lot harder than your previous level uh, that you submitted to me. Um, was it like a week ago or something? <laughs> uh, you know, the. What was it called? Ballman. Yeah, like Ballman warning. Pretty much like here. Uh, Ballman warning, not for beginners. That one was rather easy and did not take me too long. Um, this one, yeah, did not take too long either, but it definitely it definitely has a lot more instant death situations. So yeah, uh, <laughs> it definitely was quite a bit harder. And yeah, you know, I, I would cut out quite a bit of footing, uh, footage there. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh well, but yeah, you know, nice visuals, some cool enemy placements, and some nice gimmick usage, uh, nice gimmick usage there, so overall a pretty good stage gear boy, so yeah, I will just leave it at that, so thank you guys for watching, and have a nice day.